Welcome to the Macat Multimedia Series, a Macat analysis of C.S. Lewis's Mere Christianity. The moral law tells us the tune we have to play. Our instincts are merely the piano keys. C.S. Lewis is best known for his children's fiction, but in World War II, he wrote on different Christian topics for a BBC radio series. These writings were later published as a book called Mere Christianity. Lewis's main aim was to explain the Christian faith and provide a framework in which it could be both accepted and applied. Lewis argues that there is a universal moral law governing human nature, telling us what humans ought to do. Although the concept of morality varies from culture to culture, Lewis believes that basic moral principles are universal. For example, principles that tell us killing, stealing, and lying is bad. He believes that this moral law cannot be subject to scientific inquiry as it is ultimately a sign of something beyond the material world that brought all things into existence. God. C.S. Lewis said, God made us, invented us as a man invents an engine. To explain Lewis's thinking better, let's expand on this comparison and imagine a car park full of vehicles. There are all sorts of vehicles, from scooters and motorcycles to cars and trucks. Although they are superficially similar in shape and color, they all have similarities. They all have wheels, an engine, and some sort of steering. A person discovering motorized vehicles for the first time could easily come to the conclusion that someone had invented the idea of a vehicle because of the similarities they all have. In the same way, the existence of universal moral principles gave Lewis the belief that these principles must have been created by God. Vehicles also have something else in common. Maintenance determines how well they will function. Each vehicle needs the correct fuel, a charged battery, and air in its tires. Lewis believed the same could be said for humans. They needed to obey God's moral laws to function properly. If they did not obey, society and relationships with God would break down. For the car to thrive, it must also be filled with the right fuel. Just as Lewis believed humans can only thrive if they are filled with both neighborly love and the love of God. All the rules and guidelines for keeping the car in tip-top condition are written in the manual. C.S. Lewis saw the Bible as a sort of manual for humans, showing Christians how they should live their life according to God. Mere Christianity became one of the classic Christian texts of the 20th century. A more detailed examination of C.S. Lewis's ideas can be found in the Macat Analysis.